And this is a technique I've been doing for 15 years before any softness focusing effect was available. And it works out so beautifully. But you need to do section by section. So I'm going to pick up this area here. Command J. So I've created a new layer of that section. No feathering, nothing. A new layer of that section. And I'm going to do filter, blur, Gaussian blur. And I'm going to soften it as much as I want. I, I need a, a really nice softening there. Like that. But don't forget, it's a, it's a layer. It doesn't, uh, it doesn't need to be at that amount. So this is what happens to that layer. It's softened. So now I'm going to go to that layer and change the opacity. Bring it down back to, to the original so it blends nicely into the background. You see, I want her text just to be left a little bit, but there's a highlight there shining. I want to get rid of it also. So that's section one. Now I'm going to select her nose area, just like that. Just an approximate selection. Command J, blur, Gaussian blur. Change the opacity. I don't do it in one go because she's going to look plasticky. I want to do it section by section so I don't lose the texture, the look of her face. Okay, that's quite good. It's quite soft. So I'm going to change the opacity to somewhere there. Let me show you that section to show you what I mean. Before and after. It just cleans up. It gives you that beautiful feature. 